they were expecting, but their characters weren't. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 funniest ways TV shows covered up actresses' pregnancy. You could sing the baby to sleep and tell it fairy tales and act out all the witch parts. You're serious? Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, the actresses had humorous ways of hiding or working their pregnancies into their respective TV shows. We're excluding shows where they wrote the pregnancy into the storyline. Because some of these pregnancies reveal plot points, consider this your spoiler alert. What the hell do you think you're doing, huh? Showing my unborn baby how an ass gets kicked. Oh. Number 10, Angela Kinsey, The Office. So glad we were finally oh. able to do this. So glad. No, yeah. no. We Fans of this sitcom will know that Angela Martin was Little Preg in season 8. But in season 4, actress Angela Kinsey was pregnant in real life. Since her character wasn't pregnant this time, she used some typical and not-so-typical ways to hide her baby bump. Playing a character in an office environment sure came in handy. Angela was often filmed in her cubicle, at the Xerox machine, or hiding behind objects. But in a particularly memorable scene from Season 4's Goodbye Toby, Angela and Dwight find themselves in a compromising position to say the least. She might have been caught in the act, but her pregnancy wasn't. <gasps> Number 9. Leah Remini, The King of Queens Oh, I just stopped at that falafel place. I don't know why I keep having falafel. I kind of hate it. This actress has openly discussed gaining 80 pounds during her pregnancy. Instead of making Carrie Heffernan pregnant, this sitcom embraced Leah's weight gain in a very convenient way. In a recurring storyline, Carrie finds herself looking for work, but also lounging around in sweats or a bathrobe. Perfect outfits for concealing a baby bump. She can also be seen clutching a pillow on her stomach or relaxing in bed. Carrie finds work just as Leah's pregnancy becomes more noticeable, giving her more ways to hide her bump. We actually get brief shots of her pregnancy towards the season finale, but overall, we'd say this cover-up worked in Carrie and Leah's favor. I finished my report. What? Yeah, I worked so hard this week and then I finished early, so for the rest of the weekend, it's just you and me on the couch, buddy. Number 8. Julia Louis-Dreyfus, Seinfeld. Elaine. You gotta have a baby! Elaine Bennis didn't have kids of her own, but Julia Louis-Dreyfus is a mother of two. Julia was pregnant throughout season 3 of Seinfeld. Since Elaine wasn't expecting, the producers had to get creative. There were the usual larger coats and hiding behind objects. In season 3's The Subway, Elaine is on her way to a lesbian wedding, wearing an oversized red coat and carrying her gift on her stomach. Things get claustrophobic pretty quick, and the subway stalls for what seems like an eternity. What results is Elaine's totally relatable and hilarious internal monologue. It's morphing! It's morphing! <laughs> yes! Pregnant or not, we've all been there. Elaine also went to Europe for the first couple of episodes of season four, returning after Julia's maternity leave. Number seven, Lauren Lane, the nanny. This actress, who played Maxwell Sheffield's business partner Cece Babcock, was expecting throughout season five of The Nanny. Cece dropped some very obvious hints that Lauren Lane is having a baby. I was watching this rerun of Seinfeld, and Elaine must have been, I don't know, 12 months pregnant. <laughs> and they didn't even acknowledge it. They just kept hiding her behind these huge props. She first jokes about another pregnant sitcom star and carries the usual large props. In an especially funny scene, Cece later enters with a giant sign that says baby. There's no subtlety whatsoever, but that's what makes it work. As Lauren's pregnancy progressed, so did Maxwell, Fran, and Cece's love triangle. After Maxwell and Fran become engaged in a later episode, the devastated Cece is institutionalized. But not to worry, she comes back soon enough. Hello, hello, I'm back! <laughs> well, what's with the sourpusses? Who died? <laughs> Number 6, Zoe Deschanel, New Girl. Thank you. Thank you for inviting me. For much of New Girl's fifth season, this adorkable actress and singer was pregnant. The show used conventional and not-so-conventional ways to hide her growing bump. In the season premiere, Zoe was not far along, so they stuck to the usual baggier clothes and hiding behind objects. And of course, no premiere is complete without Jess falling downstairs and using a motorized scooter. By episode 3, Zoe was further along, so Jess began serving on jury duty, which gave her plenty of screen time sitting down. Megan Fox served as a replacement roommate until Jess's return. Hi! Oh my god! I am so sorry. Nobody was here when I got home and the bed just looked so good. I went full Goldilocks and you must be Reagan! It's so good to meet you! Number 5. Kyler Lee, Grey's Anatomy. 
Being a doctor is not an easy job, especially at Seattle Grace. Ever wonder why Lexi stuffed her face in season five? In real life, Kyler Lee was pregnant. So while Grey's Anatomy used the usual filming techniques to hide her baby bump, they also made Lexi stress eat. Lexi chows down at home, but especially at work. She's also got quite the sweet tooth, craving Reese's Cups, Twinkies, and chocolate. Frankly, we don't blame her. All this stress eating causes Lexi to put on a bit of weight, which leads to a brutally honest but cheeky comment from sister Meredith. Humongous but or not, though, the Greys are as close as ever. It's true, I had to get the scrubs with the elastic waistband. Number four, Jane Leaves, Frasier. You're light as a feather. <laughs> While Niles and Daphne have their own baby in the series finale, Jane Leaves was pregnant throughout season eight. Instead of hiding the pregnancy in a conventional way, the show had an ingenious solution. Go on. I need a few more minutes to get ready. <laughs> Daphne starts overeating and even hides snacks around the apartment. Strangely enough, everyone but Niles seems to notice. That is, until she falls and can't get up. After some heavy lifting by Niles, Frazier, and Martin Crane, she's back up again. As her overeating goes from bad to worse, Niles suggests she goes to a weight loss retreat, which explains her absence for a few episodes. As far as covering up a pregnancy goes, this way is funny, clever, and poignant all at once. Oh God, I can't stop eating, I'm out of control. Number three, Melissa Fumero, Brooklyn Nine-Nine. Is anyone gonna buy it? I mean, do I look pregnant? Unlike some other shows on this list, Brooklyn Nine-Nine didn't always hide Melissa Fumero's pregnancy. Early on, they chose the usual oversized bags, coats, and even a gift basket. But as season three progressed, the show decided to make the most out of her growing bump. In the episode Maximum Security, Amy goes undercover as a pregnant prisoner after Rose's fake bump backfires. While Amy's real identity is under wraps, her pregnancy sure isn't. She tries to get information from inmate Maura Figgis, putting herself in all kinds of danger. Well, at least Jake thinks so. Amy earns Maura's trust regardless, making her one badass mama to be on and off screen. This is so sweet. Now kiss her belly. Boy all. Number two, Jane Krakowski, 30 Rock. I'm a little baffled over here. To quote 30 Rock executive producer Robert Carlock, no child should have Jenna Maroney for a mother. So when Jane Krakowski became pregnant with her son, the show went to great lengths to hide her bump. They started out with conventional tricks, like having Jenna hold bags and filming her sitting down. But as her pregnancy continued, they came up with more unique ideas. The notoriously non-maternal Jenna suddenly really wants a baby and even has a hysterical pregnancy. In the fifth season finale, Jenna outdoes herself, walking around Central Park in an oversized dog costume. There you are, fat dog. You'll go in the crate tonight. 30 Rock not only covered up Jane's pregnancy, they also used it to her character's advantage. Seriously, imagine if Jenna really was a mother. <laughs> it would be horrible. Number one, Allison Hannigan, How I Met Your Mother. Lily, the belly, open! This actress's second pregnancy was written into season seven of this beloved sitcom. However, the show decided to hide Allison's first pregnancy in season four. That is, until we learn about the gang's resumes. While the friends discuss entries that don't have anything to do with their current jobs, Lily's resume shows her to be quite the competitive eater. Back in 1995, Lily won a hot dog eating contest after downing 29 dogs in only eight minutes. As she's proclaimed the winner, Lily, the belly Aldrin, lives up to her nickname, revealing Allison's real life baby bump. Hilarious and incredibly creative, this pregnancy cover up is not only our number one, it's also legend, wait for it, dairy. How is that relevant to teaching kindergarten? It teaches kids that. I can eat a lot of hot dogs very quickly. Yeah, but you can't do it anymore. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day.